William's rift with Harry is the hardest thing he has faced since Diana's death. The royal brothers used to be very close but in recent years their relationship has hit the rocks. The Duke of Sussex first publicly hinted that he and William were no longer on overly affectionate terms in an interview with Tom Bradby during a tour to South Africa in 2019. Harry told the ITV presenter that he and his older brother were on different paths. The rift has since shown no sign of healing, as Harry confided to Oprah Winfrey during his infamous interview on March 8. Harry told the media mogul that their relationship was still one of space at the moment. In an interview with OK! Magazine, Duncan Larkham said Prince William had been deeply affected by the fallout. The author of the book Prince Harry, The Inside Story said, there's no doubt this is one of the hardest things that William has gone through, the hardest since his mother died. He feels he has lost his brother and his best friend. Princess Diana was tragically killed in a car crash in Paris in 1997. She died alongside fiancé Dodi al Fade, the son of the former owner of Harrods, Mohammed al Fade. William and Harry were just 15 and 12 respectively at the time of her death and walked behind her coffin at her public funeral. The two brothers have commissioned a statue in her memory, which they plan to unveil on July 1st. The Duke of Sussex is desperately hoping to attend the event in Kensington Palace's sunken garden, a friend told The Telegraph. The date marks what would have been the 60th birthday of Princess Diana and the report suggests they want to put on a united front at the event in an attempt to move past their rift. It will mark the first time the brothers have seen each other since Harry left the UK to start a new life with Meghan and Archie in California.